Hi guys, this is Mr. Three Four Three, and now I'm going to do another nerf review on the um, long strike. So, sorry, this I haven't done a nerf review in ages. Um, I just never got time to doing it. Uh, there's two more on the way. There's the nerf hellfire and the um, nerf nightfinder. But now it's the nerf long strike CSX. So it has 13 parts to it. Um, when it comes, it has the barrel, the main blaster, the scope the stock, the um, two parts to the handles, and uh, the clip, and the six bullets, so that's pretty good. Um, really easy to assemble this gun, and you know, it's just not hard at all. Unfortunately, I'll just go through the bad parts. Um, once you have attached the stock, and um, you cannot get it back off, um, so you might want to use the vault stock first before you, before you put it on, so you can get the most out of it. Um, also, it, well, this is a good part. It does hold two extra clips there and there, but it does not come with the extra clips, so that's the other bad. Um, right, let's go on to the goods. So it has lots of different scope options. Um, so there's obviously this. You can zoom through there. These can come up. You can have it through there. It's you know really good. Loads of scope options. You can take that off completely to have this to lift up from the barrel and you can zoom through there to there, which also is a good scope option. And you may just have that if you wanted to. So yeah. The barrel has lots of handlebars, really big one here and a little one there. And it's really long, it does make the bullet go quite far, which is good. Um, let me just say that this gun has a really long range, so um, yeah, because it's a sniper. Um, right, so now I will show you the blaster. So, I will just give you a quick fire test so I can show you how the reloading action works. So, trigger, don't have to, it's not too hard to hold down. Please, just pull that and pull forward, ready to fire, there we are, so reloading, there's that there, if there was also instructions on the side so I can help you, pull back, pull it, and the clip will come right out, and yep it can hold six bullets, seven if um, you really wanted to but it won't go as far, also uh, there's one more bad thing I'm going to tell you, um, it is kind of unpredictable. I mean, if you wanted like the better average, it is probably better distance without the barrel on. But sometimes it can go further with the barrel on, so it's a bit unpredictable. You can't, you know. Um, so the barrel is supposed to make it go a lot further, which is supposed to guide the bullet through. Um, just sometimes, not too often though. Um, for looks, that does look better, obviously, but. If you want it for a Nerf War, I would probably recommend just that. So, also, again with the clips, um, it's really stuck in there, um, they won't fall off um, when you're doing a Nerf War. So, so on the other side. So, yeah. Um, also, there are um, handlebars on the main blaster, big one here and a little one just there. Um, one last thing, there is this here where you can pull down to um, to get um, the jam bullets. Doesn't happen too often. I've never actually used that in my whole life with this um, gun. So, yep, yeah, that's another good thing. You will it hardly ever jams. You'll never really use, need to use that. So um, that's pretty much it to this review. Um, apart from the fact that it does cost um, £25, no, definitely worth it. So, yeah, um, once again there are instructions on the side to help you if you are having trouble and an avoid injury thing, which you don't really need to know about. So that's pretty much it for this review. Look out for the next one, the Hailfire, after that the Nightbinder. So, right, thank you for watching this review. Please comment, rate and subscribe and goodbye.